In today's video, I am going to do a technical analysis on Aterian Incorporated, ticker ATER. Aterian Incorporated, together with its subsidiaries, operates as a technology-enabled consumer products company in North America and internationally. It provides artificial intelligence Mohawk e-commerce engine, a software technology platform which uses machine learning, natural language processing, and data analytics to design, develop, market, and sell products. The company was formerly known as Mohawk Group Holdings Incorporated and changes its name to Aterian Incorporated in April 2021. Aterian Incorporated was founded in 2014 and is headquartered in New York, New York. Before going into technical analysis, please subscribe to my channel and tap on the bell icon to turn on notifications for future videos. Let's get started. Let's see its price action. Here in the 5-minute candlestick chart, we can see that there is a support at $11.18 and a resistance at $13.23. The stock is currently in the midway of the zone, $13.23 to $11.18. Since there is a consolidation in the zone price action-based trading would be the ideal way to go here. Buy when the stock goes above the resistance and sell when it goes below the support. Let's look for patterns. In the 5 minute time frame, we can see a downward trend channel in the chart, and the stock is currently crossed the upper trend line of the channel, and from here there is a chance that the stock could go up. When the stock price break out of the upper trend line, there is bullish sentiment in the stock, so it is a definite buying sign. Let's take a look at indicators. We can see here the MACD and stochastic RSI of the stock in a 30 minute time frame. Here we can see that the stochastic RSI has made a flat bearish crossover and also the MACD is in a bearish trend. This signifies the bearishness of the stock in the 5 minute time frame and tells us that the stock will be dropping its price at the beginning of the market hours. But both these indicators also show a bullish tilt. So there is a large chance for a trend reversal here, and looking at the candles we can see some greenish Mariboza candles being formed which signifies bullishness. Another indicator in the 5-minute time frame of MACD and stochastic RSI is that the MACD is showing the start of an upward trend and the RSI also showed the start of a downward crossover. So, all the indicators are pointing towards a bearish sentiment in the stock. This means that the stock might be in a bearish trend at the beginning of the rally. Let's have the moving average chart. In the 30-minute time frame of the moving average chart, we can see that the stock is trading above the 20-day, 50-day, and 200-day moving average. The stock has taken the 20-day moving average as a support in the past, so there is a chance for that to happen again if the stock goes down and also the 20-day moving average looks like it is about to cross down the 50-day moving average. So if that happens the stock price will go down so short selling would be the best option there. The Heikinashi candle chart is showing a bearish signal in the 5-minute time frame. This tells us that the stock might be in a bullish trend for a day. So while doing intraday trading, the buy option would be good to go for. The Heikinashi in all other time frames is also pointing towards a bullish signal for the short term. To conclude, overall, the stock is showing a bullish trend for the future, and the technical give out a clear bullish sentiment so swing trades would be a good option here. Also, trade based on price action and also do position sizing, so that you can average out your stock if it goes against your trade. Subscribe to my channel for more stock and crypto analysis and price prediction every trading day. Have a great one.